so there was a post um, about Dr. Ben Carlson um, and speaking about the um, female female um, shelters and homes and things like that. Males do not belong in female segregated spaces, separated spaces, because males do not belong in places of vulnerability with females. During the time of the kings, the kings would have eunuchs that were men who castrated themselves to take care of the women in the house so that they would not mess with the women. So unless you consider yourself a eunuch, you don't belong in female separated spaces of vulnerability. It's just that simple because you don't know how to keep your hands to yourself. You go in places where women are, prisons, shelters, homeless shelters, restrooms, and you don't know how to leave females alone. So you don't belong in places of female vulnerability. Stay out. It's just that simple. I don't care what you, what you think in your head. If you were born with a penis, you are a male. It doesn't matter if the female reproductive system is not working. It doesn't matter if the female reproductive system haven't had a child. It doesn't matter if the female had a hysterectomy and has part of her female reproductive system taken out. It doesn't matter. You don't belong in a female space. You are not an adult human female. You are an adult human male, which makes you a man. I don't care if you chopped it off. If you chopped it off, that makes you a unit. And if you chopped it off and it makes you a eunuch, that means you are asexual. You don't bother women going into women's prisons talking about, oh, I'm a lesbian. It's just that simple. If you cut it off and say you're a lesbian, you're a liar. Because when the men chopped off their dick and their, and their balls in, in biblical times or even just in times of kings and all that stuff, they were put in charge of the harems because they were no longer considered to be functioning males. So if you chop off your balls and your dick and you still want to pursue a woman, then you are a liar. You are confused and you are a fetished, but you are not a woman. You are not a lesbian. You are a pervert. It's just that simple. Oh, well, I had mental I know a person that had mental issues, had to live as a woman for three years before they went and got the, the operation and married a man. Then turn around and say, oh, well, I'm a, I'm a lesbian. Back, way back when I was young, yes, people had to go through hell to have operations and it may be different from back then they may have really lived as women but this shit y'all pulling today is nothing but the devil it's evil it's wrong and it's wicked so males people who were born with penises and scrotums and testicles semen semen shooters they don't belong in female spaces of vulnerability. It's just that simple. I'm not going to change the thing. I'm not going to edit it. I'm not. I'm going to tell you exactly how I'm telling you right now. I'm not going to change it. I'm not going to redo the video. I'm going to say it the way it is. With my mess ups and everything. Because it frustrates me. Males cannot be females. Because males are males. Males cannot be women because a, fem a woman is an adult human female. That, it means something. Female means something. Female is a physical reality, not a mental disease. 